38 degrees. The Walk for Dyslexia takes place next weekend, and here to tell us more about the walk and also the beneficiary, we have Sheila Tony Lilsacker, and we also have her daughter, Haley. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. Now, Sheila, first let's start out with the walk. This all benefits the Children's Dyslexia Center uh, downtown, and Haley's going to tell us a little bit more about that, but tell us more about the walk. The walk is the Children's Dyslexia Center's biggest fundraiser of the year. Um, it helps support the no-cost tutoring mm -hmm. that the kids get at the center. It's one-on-one -on -one specialized tutoring for the for the kids. It's just absolutely amazing. And you take part in the tutoring. Haley, tell us a little bit about um, how long you've been doing that. I was doing it since I was, I've been there for two years mm -hmm. and they te helped me teach me about reading and mm -hmm. stuff and it proved really good. And so you're having some trouble in school beforehand? Yes, I have. And so what's the difference been now for you? Good. Like I could read the stuff and do the problems in math and it goes really good. Oh, good. So now are you done at the center or you're going to keep going? I'll keep going for the summer then I would skip a year then come back a year see if it approved and what kinds of things do you do at the center um first i start doing reading about mm -hmm. spelling and stuff then i read then i do some more reading <laughs> more and that's really what matters isn't it yes. well sheila tell us a little bit about the difference that it's made for haley and the changes you've noticed the changes in Haley are absolutely phenomenal. She more confidence in herself, more willing to pick up a book to read it before she would pick up picture books mm -hmm. and kind of memorize as you were going along. But now she picks it up and she reads. She's improved like three grade levels since she started two years ago. And you have a team for Haley too. We do. It's called Haley's Helpers this year. Is It really helps any support. Amazing. And we should also mention that the Children's Dyslexia Center is, as you've mentioned, it is free of charge and that's only been able to be offered because of the work for, um, through the Masons. Right. And also uh, for their big fundraiser. It is. It's amazing. The support that the Masons and the community itself gives to the Children's Dyslexia Center to help these kids. So let's get down to the specifics for the walk. Now everybody gathers at the Vilas Park Shelter. Right? Yes. yes. On um, Saturday the 21st. Right. Okay, I had to make sure I got that date right. And can people still register once they get there? They can. Well, there's pre registration at 7 30. Okay. The walk will begin at 8 30. Otherwise, um, online too, as well, registration can be taken. And it's a scenic area too. Right it's around the it's park. beautiful. And how far do you go? It's a 5K. Okay, so it's manageable for right. everyone. Mm -hmm. You'll be there? Excellent with your whole team. Yes. Well, we thank you so much for joining us and hopefully you'll be able to join the Walk for Dyslexia or if you need more information about the Children's Dyslexia Center, we will provide that on news links. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you.